Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So my name is Kelvin Dela, a freelancer on Fiverr. And today we'll be continuing the Prem Style edit we started last week. So if you were there for the first tutorial, which I have uploaded on my YouTube already, link in description. We basically created a template for it and in the part two, which is this one, we'll be adding videos and slow motion to it. So let's get to it. So first thing we are going to do is open your old project files, the one we did the first time. And since we'll be adding videos to it, new videos to it, you might want to remove what we already have here, which are the pictures we created to do the first one. So, but if this is your first time doing it, you can also follow through, except you might not know how to use the keyframes. So I would advise you, you watch the first video, how we created the templates and develop it later on using this video. So first thing we are going to do is, as usual, we import our project files. So I'll be using solo leveling, uh, an AMV edit of solo leveling to do it. So you can use whichever video you want to use. So first thing we are going to do is, import our files in this video we'll be using just one new file which is the solo leveling video import that in your timeline now the next thing you're going to do is you play and cut it remember there are eight places so you cut it eight times using the beat so you sync it with the beat so we are going to begin the cutting process the splitting process of course so you split don't worry about it just split the clips according to the according to the sound just like how we did the first time okay perfect so now we're going to move this one and this one you take out the footages where the song fits So you might want to hide your two black screens that we used the first time and also you you might want to also hide the filter so we we'll see the video very well you you hide both filters so we we'll see the video very well next thing we're going to do is uh, next thing we're going to do is add the slow motion so first you want to turn on main magnet track that will bring all the videos together at the end we are only going to use this eight so then you add the slow motion to it you go to speed you head on to speed i am using the default view so this is how the default view looks like so you go to speed and you reduce and you reduce the speed to let's go with 0 0.6 times 0 0.6 so you do that for the rest times 0 0.6 okay perfect now depending on the frame rate of your video i would advise you to use um, the slow motion the smooth slow-mo i would advise you to use this, the smooth slow-mo but it depends on your on the frame rate of your original video so mine is um 4k 60 fps so there's no need to turn it on since the video is already smooth but let's say your video is not um smooth and you want to make it more smoother because you are going to be using a slow motion so you want your video to be smooth let's just turn it on and we use optical flow i think this is a pro feature so if you don't have CapCut pro you wouldn't be able to use it the 
perfect so the features are applying so now what we are going to do next is we'll do the splitting again just like how we did before so you go in and split your clips again okay so now we are done with the splitting what we are going to do next is replace the clips with the original with the part we want to use my original clip is 1 minute 41 seconds so I'll just go ahead and replace it with the part I want to use so you can also go ahead and do the same for yours okay so we are done replacing our clips now now we'll watch it and make sure everything is in place before we'll turn on our effects and the black screens again okay so now what we are going to do now is turn on our two black screens the keyframes movement and our effects so when we preview it this is how it's going to be like okay so thanks for watching this tutorial as well this is a part two of the Prem Star series. We are breaking down the edits to make sure you understand and to make sure you'll be able to do it as well on your own. It looks it might look difficult, but it's actually it's not difficult at all. So if you haven't watched part one already, you can find the link in the description where you can watch the part one. If you have any edits that you want us to break down together, you can send it to my email or my whatsapp number i have them all in the description you can send me the link and tell me what you want to learn about it whether everything or just part of it i'll go through the edit or the template and i'll break it down and make a video for you and also don't forget to subscribe for part three where we'll be doing the final one which is adding the voiceover and the text thanks for watching this tutorial once again see you next time